Hi folks, I'm just going to show you this video. This is a Lincoln 2005 Navigator. And there are a lot of people out there that don't actually do mechanical stuff, so they won't know where the fluids go in their car. So I'm just going to show you, straightforward, where to put the fluids. So the power steering fluid, if you go on the driver's side of the car, you'll see three, uh, three tanks. This one here, right here, closest to the, to the front of the car, is... Uh, the power steering fluid. In my um, navigator you can actually see a little picture of a, of a steering wheel on it so you know. Now the engine coolant or the radiator. Yes the radiator is up front of the car however there's a reservoir, an overflow reservoir for it and that is this tank right here. So you take that lid off, again never do it when it's hot and then you can fill up the radiator fluid. The power brake fluid is right here. That tank right there is for the power brakes. That's the brake fluid. Now that's the dipstick for measuring the um, amount of oil that is in the car. And the other fluid is the oil which goes, this is now on the passenger side, and you just simply take this off. You can use a funnel or if you have really good pouring skills and you just put it into there. Now, I've got some bad news for you if you're looking for transmission fluid. Now this new design of the navigator does not allow easy maintenance for the um, transmission. It's basically designed for only a mechanic to go into, even just to check it. There's no dipstick, there's no filler tube, there's nothing. You actually have to go under the vehicle and with a specialized tool open up the uh, plug for the transmission and sort of stick your finger in and to find out what kind of condition the fluid is. So that's a mechanic only thing. I guess they've done that so that they can keep making more money by putting uh, mechanics on the job instead of just owner friendly. Oh yes, one more fluid. Um, the washer fluid on the passenger side in front of the battery, this is the washer fluid for your window washer. There you go. Now you've got all the fluid locations. Should be fairly easy for you to find. Thanks for watching. Hope that helps.